Hey guys, it's Shadow the Rat, and for today's video, I will be reviewing this hammock here. Uh, this was sent to me by the owner of the Instagram page, Moose and Fred 2020. And as always, if you would like to check out their work, you can do so by clicking on the link below. Uh, I will have it in the description and comments, and they make custom hammocks. So this here is a prototype for one of their hammocks, and they asked me to review it and just uh, kind of talk about uh, anything that could be improved, anything I liked. And uh, Bean here was keeping me company. Are you going to get out of there now, Bean? And that's why I decided to start filming now, because someone was in the hammock for some reason, you little weirdo. Uh, but anyways, this is a very nice hammock, and I'm going to talk about it some, and I will show you some clips of the rats in it, especially now that Bean has left. Okay, so first of all, I really like how it's put together. Uh, you can see kind of the stitching here, or uh, I don't know if you'd call that stitching, but uh, you can see right here how it's connected, and that looks very seamless to me which is something that I like. And on top of that, I really like this removable bottom uh, because it feels like this will make it easier to clean the hammock since your rats, when they're in there, they're mainly going to be marking the bottom and if they pee in their hammocks, they're mainly going to be peeing on the bottom. So by having something you can just easily remove and clean, that means that you won't have to clean the rest of the hammock as much. And honestly, I haven't seen this in hammocks before, so this is pretty cool to me. Uh, and another thing I like about it is just that it helps to give the hammock some shape I feel like with some of these 3D hammocks, like the cube hammock, one of the problems you can have is that they tend to be a little bit saggy. And when you're hanging them up, the front part, you know, the top, that's not going to sag, but the bottom might sag. And so by having this bottom in here, it's really nice. <laughs> oh my God, Bean, because <laughs> what the heck, Bean? Okay, so having the bottom is really nice because it means that, <laughs> I'm sorry, Beach is cracking me up. Okay, so by having the bottom in there, it's really nice because it means it won't lose shape at the bottom. Oh my god, why do why you have to do this to me, Bean? Why do you have to be cute all the time? Oh my gosh, she's such a cute little sleepy bean. She's such a cute little sleepy bean. So anyways, like I was saying, I really like the removable bottom, and I really like the make of the hammock. But on top of that, I also kind of like the square shape here, the entrance. I just feel like having a wider entrance makes it more accessible to the rats. Uh, I could see it going the other way if you have rats that really like being in the dark. Uh, but usually with these hammocks, they already have three sides covered, so the rats aren't really in need of any more uh, cover. And so I think this is a really nice addition. Plus, of course, it makes it easy to pull out the bottom right here. Now, I also like the size of the hammock. I feel like it's large enough to house several rats in it. Uh, and pretty much the only thing that I could really critique here is just the attachment points. And uh, that's just because I really don't like fabric attachment points. Because if your rats decide to chew anything in the hammock, they're probably going to target these first just because they are little butts like that. And once they chew through one of these, then you have the issue of, well, now you have a hammock with only three sides that can hang up and that makes it really off balance. And it's really hard to fix another side on there. So I can't really fault the hammock for that because I haven't seen any other sorts of attachments on cube hammocks, but I wish there was another way to attach them that was just perhaps a little bit more durable if the rats decided to, well, start chewing on them. So yeah, other than the attachments here, there's pretty much nothing here that I would change. Uh, this looks like your typical cube hammock. It's a very nice quality and I like the removable bottom quite a bit. Uh, it's just a really nice hammock. And yeah, I just wanted to say thank you for sending me this. Uh, hopefully that review did it justice. Uh, but anyways, the rats seem to like it and I think it's good quality. So yeah, go check it out if you have some time. And um, again, I really hope that this review did it justice. So thank you guys for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye.